Good morning, lovelies. Zoe 2.2 .2 with some more Pokemon Go goodness for you. And today is Abra Community Day. And we're actually already like two and a bit hours into the event. Went out and did our traditional at this point live stream for the first few hours of the comm day. We've been very, very lucky. We got blessed with seven shinies in the live stream. That's in the first hour and a half. So already off the base. Uh, my shiny luck is way better than any other normal comm day. The majority of these were off incense as well. I'd say about 80, 70 to 80% of the ones that we got on today's live stream were from my incense. So happy news for anyone playing from home. The incense spawns have been awesome. Uh, and the shiny rate seems to be perfectly high. I don't know if it's going to be more shiny, like an increased shiny rate compared to other comm days. Or if it's purely the fact that I'm getting such frequent spawns and so many catches. But it's a very lucky comm day for me so far. Before we get started as well, I just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who jumped on board and grabbed one of the reusable face masks that we've been selling over with my merch company at the moment. If you guys haven't heard about it, we are basically doing, uh, you know, me, trainer tips, every other creator that is doing this campaign with Crowdmade. For every uh, reusable face mask sold through Crowdmade, Crowdmade is matching the, matching the, the purchase basically and buying and donating a medical mask for medical workers that need these masks at the moment. I'm also donating all of my profits from the masks towards the same effort and towards mental health services, uh, just to kind of try and help get everyone through this crazy time in the world. So thank you guys so, so much. I've been able to see from overnight, just like the massive spike. So thank you everyone who's supported that. You are absolute champions. If you want to grab one yourself as well, the link will be in the description. So every single mask purchased, we are matching one and donating to medical workers in need. On that note, I hope you guys are all doing well too and staying safe. So let's jump in and see where I left off. Wow, that is a weird visual bug for the star piece. Minus five minutes. Uh, I might need to restart. Let me just check this guy. Restart the app. It's a bit of a visual bug at the moment with the incense uh, and the star pieces. The star pieces are not stacking either, which is a bit unfortunate. But the Go Plus is fixed. So, pick that one up. Oh, I ran away. Anyway, <laughs> when I wrapped up the live stream, we were on seven shinies. Now, I committed to doing a set of exercises for every single shiny. You might have seen my post on Twitter here. I'm doing some form of exercise for every single shiny I get. I mean, the irony already being that the time I commit to doing this, I have more shinies in the first hour and a half than I ever had before in a comm day. My Go Plus was plusing the whole way home. So let me, oh, I can already see one there. Oh my God, let's see how many we already are on for the day. I'm gonna type in shiny and I try and like I N. When I tap the Y, I'm gonna look away. Oh my God, that's a lot of sh oh my. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 11. Oh, my legs are going to be sore today. 11 shinies. Good Lord. That is more than, that's just obscene. I could retire right now. It's 1.30 in the afternoon. I could just like turn the Go Plus. I could save my fires. I could, I could not destroy myself with exercise, but I mean, like, look, let's do it. It's all going towards a good cause. Good, you know, activity, keep our heart healthy. Oh my gosh. Not likely IVs. Kind of rubbish. That's weird. Uh, terrible IVs. Terrible IVs. Terrible IVs. The one, the one that we caught out and about, this is a yes, very likely. This one is going to get evolved for sure. Really, really nice one there. No. Uh, this is, it's, it's a bit of a mix, honestly, with the IVs, to be honest. I'm going to let the Go Plus keep doing its thing, and I'll put on another star piece in a second as well, because three times Stardust catch is my focus, so... Definitely, I want to catch through my whole research stack. I've got some fully evolved Pokemon in there. I've got some Blossoms stacked up there at third stage evolution. I've got some uh, Slowbros stacked in there. They're uh, what, second stage, so good amount of Stardust. So we'll see where we end up on that. Here is my starting Stardust for this event as well. Uh, and I'll share with you, I guess, where we get to either today or tomorrow. I might not put everything into one video, just so I mean, you don't have to sit through six hours worth of stuff. <laughs> but regardless, if it gets split into two videos, I will uh, make sure to commit to, first of all, the exercises as well, film them, uh, and then also show you guys where I end for Stardust. Zoe from the future here, just quickly jumping in to say that also the Abra flea rate has been nerfed. So if you throw on ball and Abra jumps out, it won't necessarily flee. Keep in mind that the uh, incense spawns do despawn pretty quickly. So it could just be a despawn as to why your Pokemon is running away. But Abra, if it jumps out, you can try again to catch it. So don't worry if you get a shiny, it won't necessarily run away. 
Please catch it quick though if it's on an incense because they reset really quickly and that will make them flee, which has meant they've already despawned from the map. Additionally, you can get, I believe, five photo bombs from Abra. So if you take a photo of your buddy, a snapshot picture, uh, you can get photo bombed by Abra. If it is a shiny, it will appear as a shiny on the map, which is pretty sick. So you'll know immediately if you got a shiny from your snapshot. But yeah, I need to make my way through this whole stack because there's a lot of spice in this. We'll do that in a second too. Also, also, I've already completed the special research. It was super duper easy. Let me put up on screen for you guys right now, my shinies from the live stream and also the research and in terms of its difficulty. Oh, there we go. Hydration Nation pays off. I want to get that sparkle again, but we're not going to risk it because it was on the incense and it could despawn. There we go. 18 minutes in, first shiny Abra. Teeny tiny shiny. Let's see, is it going to be in? Literally type that same question. A. 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 Yo. Here we go. Thank you, Kesis, for the shiny luck right there. Chuck in quick catch guide and there's like 10 top results that will show you physically so you can see the thumbs it makes it a lot easier to explain than uh, everywhere you go uh what else shiny is what else that's what else there we go delicious shinies <laughs> just start talking about takoyaki and get the shinies that's how we do it it's like we need to end this one takoyaki but we did thankfully all good all good Yo, thank you for the shiny vibes, my guy. I'm gonna, should I risk it? I'm gonna risk it. Let's do it. For the sparkle. Beautiful. Isn't she lovely? Let's go. Bonk. Next season then. That would be amazing. Yo, you know what else is amazing? This shiny. Hell yes. Let's go. Let's. I'm gonna risk it. I'm just gonna go regular ball, no berry. Let's see. Let's see what happens. Bad throw, even. No nice. Magic. Magic, magic. Uh, Max is for Great League. Awesome. Thank you, Will. I'm totally gonna get one ready for that. Let's see the IVs. Not likely, gang. Yeah, boys. Yo, PG Comedy, hell yes, I agree. And thank you for the two, my friend. Holy dolly. Giraffe, oi, look at this. Just about back to back. Goodness gracious. Look at this. And she decent, ladies and gentlemen. I'm gonna have to do so many push ups. <laughs> yeah. <sighs> I've already lost count after count back in editing. Oh, Blossom did request a handstand, so uh, just to avoid doing literally any of the burpee requests that were in the Twitter thread, I'm gonna see if I can hold a decent handstand. I'm getting better, so uh, pray for me. Nice. Yo, this is the spot. Holy dooly. My body is going to be suffering, guys. Oh my god, why did I, why did I? Of course, the one time that I say shiny fitness challenge. We're already at uh, I think that's as a, it's because I'm going to get with having practiced in weeks. Uh, let's go see how many shinies the Go Plus has picked up during this process. Oh god. Uh, wow, I look like a mess. <laughs> Let's see, let's see. Okay, go, oh, go plus is disconnected, rip. Maybe we're in luck, ha <laughs> ha. Oh, <laughs> okay, there's one. There's one that wasn't there before. Rounding us out to 12 shinies. Honestly, guys, we can just run the go plus for this whole event and still make bank on the shinies. Are you gonna participate, Alan? Are you gonna do the, the shiny exercise challenge? Yeah. yeah? How many shinies you caught? Oh, you don't, oh, yeah, no, because no, you, know, you, you need to get your phone, won't you? I um, I gave Alan the scare, the scare, the, sca the spare Go Plus, hooked it all up for him. So I guess you probably haven't caught anything manually yourself, have you? No. Good effort. Go on, uh, type in. Oh, your Go Plus is turned off too. Go type in shiny. Oop. I spy for shiny Abra. Congrats. <laughs> Congrats. Hmm. What exercise did you have in mind? First four sets of something. 
or mm -hmm. one extreme. I think the handstand should count as an extreme. One extreme, you got anything in, in mind? Okay, this is for my four shinies. Um, we'll see how many I can do. We one, <laughs> two. Oh, is that your wrist? <laughs> yeah, it could have been. Three. Call me heavy. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. <laughs> is that count? Does that count as extreme? Are you entertained? But for real though, just like do whatever is in with your own your own range. Like if you just do a lap of the block, do with a lap of the block. <sighs> I'm gonna go and think about not exercising. Let's try and get some more shinies. Okay, so let's jump into the special research. So the special $1 investigating illusions special, special, oh my God, special research. So before you get your hype out of order, it is not a mythical, a legendary, any sort of quest like that. They always tell us if it's going to be something big, pretty clearly they hint about it pretty big for stuff like that. It is purely, hey, spoiler alert, it's not really a spoiler, it's Abra's Kadabra's and Alakazam's as we, I guess, expected, unless you got your hype out of order. So is it worth it for the $1 investigating illusions? Uh, <sighs> depends, do you have a dollar to spare? Uh, for me, yes, you get the, you get more than a dollar's worth of uh, goods from the research. The t steps to complete are very, very easy. Uh, they can all be done from home. They involve powering up, taking snapshots, transferring Pokemon, evolving Pokemon. You get more than enough candies really, uh, and plus if you have an incense on, these spawns are going to more than cover your cost to evolve certain Pokemon. In these, there's no guaranteed shiny. So I had, I think it was two Abra encounters, a Kadabra and an Alakazam. I didn't get a shiny out of any of those. I'm sure the Abras could potentially be. Uh, no word yet on if the fully evolved forms could have been shiny in the research. I guess we'll have to wait and see other reports from around the world. But in terms of, is it worth $1 worth of value? Sure. Got a couple of incense, got a chunk of stardust, got uh, some, what was it, a poffin, a rocket radar. So all of the items combined are worth more than a dollar. Could they be more valuable if you purchased a better item box, even though the item box overall will be more expensive? Uh, potentially. But to me, it's a dollar and I don't mind. To someone else though, it might not be worth the dollar. So make that assessment yourself. Uh, for whether or not it's good for your current situation. Also good timing, my incense and star piece have both completely run out. So we are currently at the three hour mark, which will be a good time to do some, oh my God, we go past another one, are you serious? Okay, it would be a good time to do some evolutions of what I got so far. Wow, that is obscene. Three hours in, 13 shinies. Oh my God, I hope you guys are getting this lucky as well. Let's definitely evolve this lovely lady all the way up to Alakazam. It's my best shiny so far. I may not get a better one today. If I don't, that's okay too. The move counter isn't anything groundbreaking. It might be kind of cool for potentially some Sylph League cups and things like that. So I might evolve myself a PVP eligible one just in case, but I'm definitely not gonna be giving my Hundo uh, Alakazam counter. Uh, if in the future it turns out to be a crazy good move, I can always elite TM it at some point. Uh, but realistically, not at this stage, not really worth it. So no stress for me to evolve this one up without, or you know, I might even change the move on this one to not give it counter, but I'm not gonna be evolving my good, good IV ones to have counter necessarily. Alakazam is a fantastic, just psychic, full, you know, crazy glass cannon, DPS. Look at that shiny Pokemon, wow. And this is a uh, female Alakazam as well. So you can tell by the shorter mustache, the female Alakazam has uh, a very small moustache, whereas a male Alakazam has the lovely, big, ooh, beautiful one. Wow, that is a nice shiny. Again, I cannot wait to see all the AR photos for these. Oh my goodness. Counter and future sight there. And it is a tiny CP. <laughs> Let's evolve up one of the males just for fun. We'll evolve up this really high CP one as well, because it can always be one that we can trade in the future for someone, re-roll IVs, uh, and at least this will save them the stardust on powering it up because it's already fairly leveled up. Just to see that nice, that nice moustache. <laughs> Even, um, you can tell from Kadabra's evolution, it has a longer middle stage moustache too. Ooh, oh, look at that, just fly the moustache out with the evolution. Look at that, that is majestic. If only I could grow a moustache like that, am I right, kids? Anyway, oh my gosh, lovely. Such a lovely shiny. Counter and Focus Blast again. I'll look into the moves at a later date, but I really, I don't care. Look at this shiny. 
Lovely. So the Go Plus is back on. I'm going to put on a star piece uh, and an incense. Let the, the Go Plus grab whatever's on the incense for a hot second and then catch through my entire research stack. So there's a whole bunch of stuff in here that we need to, oopsies, in here, that we need to grab. Let's see what we're on for Stardust at the moment. Oh, we've almost earned 200,000 Stardust today. That's including, uh, we spent a chunk to do the 10 power-ups as well. So we kind of like got ourselves back to a baseline of um, 2.5 million. We're now almost on 2.7, very nice. Okay, and let's quickly grab, we're gonna be quick catching through the stack to make the absolute most of it. So cue the fast forward. For real, how many Pokemon did I stack up in this? Goodness gracious. Hey, if you made it this long, here's a reward for you. Here's a nice little, uh, let's get that sparkle again. Beautiful. I was gonna say, I forgot I had this in here. I did not forget I had this in there. Uh, magic, my little shiny Volbeat. I feel, like, I feel like the Ultra Ball matches really nicely, the blue and the stripes. Stoked to have this one may I say. Uh, really, really hoping that I can get the Illumise before the event is done. Uh, like, what is it, Tuesday or Monday that it finishes? I need to actually get on the grind for that, maybe tomorrow. But uh, Volbeat, secured, which means we're close to the end of this stack. Holy dooly. Winner, winner. Beautiful. It's a very, uh, oh, not bad. It's a very, like, unique shiny, I think, Volbeat and Illumise. Okay, let's, uh, ooh, back to back? No. Let's clear out this stack and get that done. Holy moly. Oh my god, are y'all still here after that? That was almost, oh my god, what's that? 23 minutes straight of catching through my research stack. Oh my gosh, how much did I have in there? Hoarders, gotta, oh my god. I mean, it's worth it for the stardust. I've almost maxed out my storage. Oh my gosh. Ooh, let's see what the Stardust return was on that because it's gonna be a nice one. <laughs> I forgot to check what the remainder was. 2.7 something, I didn't check what my, my something was, but we're almost at 2.8. Almost at 2.8, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Dudes, I'm gonna put on screen the maths, but that's a, that's a nice chunk of dust. There's a nice bit of dust. Let's see the, the Go Plus wasn't going off for half of that as well, so I just keep kind of like checking. Now is the moment of truth. Was that Chansey in my stack a hundo? I know on that video you guys were saying, you stacked a hundo, you stacked a hundo. That CP I believe could also be a 98. So now is the moment of truth. I did also get a another hundo today on our live stream. Wasn't an Abra, but let's find out. It was, there you go. Winner, winner, gold stars for everyone in the chat that said this one was a hundo. There we go, beautiful Chansey. 100% and we got the the barboach. The barboach 100%. I'll, I'll, I'll evolve it, I'll max it out, use it for Great League, whatever it might be. Holy dooly. But uh, two hundos today, I cannot complain with that. Cannot complain at all. Uh, oh, before the Go Plus gets you, not a shiny. Goodness gracious, that is feral. Absolutely feral. Also, uh, shout out to Kevin with our like, distance Lucky trade, uh, we saw each other in the park this morning, so we did a very safe distance. Hello, what do you want to trade? All that jazz, and for my first ever shiny Lucky Tongue, Lucky, God, my brain is fried. Licky Tongue, and it's a Lucky, and I'm stoked with it. The IVs aren't terrible, and I'm, um, oh, I'm happy. I missed out on the uh, raid day for this one, so I'm very, very happy to have it. Whew, but, oh my gosh, we are... We're well and truly covered for shinies. I, my, my body is gonna be destroyed by the end of this event. I'm gonna have some lunch and we'll see where we end up uh, at the top of the next hour. Let's go, lunch is done. It is 3 p.m. now, so we still have plenty more time chipping away in this event. Bonk. Uh, what, two, about two hours and not 10 minutes. We have two-ish hours left. Let's check in and would you look at that. The Go Plus, two. <laughs> the Go Plus has snagged two shinies while I was having lunch. So, I mean, realistically, even if you're busy, you're working, whatever it might be for this event, as long as you're able to reconnect your Go Plus, it's gonna be doing a lot of the legwork for you. So, happy days. But you, William, how many shinies do you have? 
How many shinies does William get? Let me, I think I've got two more snapshots that I can do as well uh, to, oh, another gift. Also, Vulp, okay. The, uh, the buddy gift thing for the buddy event, it's only the buddy level that's actually like able to bring gifts for this particular event. So I sadly can't really work on leveling up. I mean, I could leveling up other buddies, but still get the gifts. Vulpix brought a gift on stream that was 52 Pokeballs, which was insane. So I'm guessing that's what the special gifts are. Again, 52 Pokeballs. Are you serious? You are a fantastic Pokemon. That's crazy. Absolutely insane. I would recommend uh, guys putting on your best buddy or one of your ultra buddies for the buddy event. And not a shiny, because it will appear on the map as a shiny for the ghost snapshot ones. Holy dooly, that means 104 Pokeballs from Vulpix just alone today. So definitely put on your the, your primo buddies at the moment because they are bringing a crazy amount of gifts. I kind of was working on my, my Gibble, working on my shiny Hapini. Uh, I wasn't getting any gifts at all. And then the minute I put Vulpix back on, poof, gifts, gifts, gifts. One more photo bomb because we did three on stream, I think. There's another one. Let's just see how many we get, I guess. Not a shiny. Yeah, cool. No pop up there. So five photo bombs. Fingers crossed. Hopefully you guys can get a nice one out of it. Let's check in and see where we're at as well. Goodness gracious, my boy. I'm gonna have to like pace this out over today and tomorrow, I think, because my body is gonna be suffering if I try to do one exercise for all of these today. Good Lord. Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 15, Abra and a shiny Volbeat. Pray for Mojo. Oh my gosh. I 1000% promise I'll keep my word and I will do one set of exercises for each of these, but I'm not gonna make you guys sit through this in a video. I'm gonna wrap this video up here. There's still two hours left of the event, so I'm gonna go and try and capitalize on that and make myself suffer even more <laughs> for your entertainment. So catch me in uh, what'll be probably Monday's video. We're gonna go ham and try and get ourselves a Illumise before this event wraps up and I will provide receipts for the remainder of this exercise that is owed. Let's do one last check as well for any hundos uh, and we'll do a recap as well on Monday for anything new that we get too. Let me know in the comments down below guys as, oh, 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 there's, oh my God, there's a shiny in the house. Oh God, it's the second I stopped screen recording. Ah, ah, the second I stopped. Ooh, that was a weird, there we go. Hey, oh no, it's another set. <laughs> Dang it. Okay, let me know in the comments down below guys as well. How did you go for shiny Abra Com Day? How many shinies did you get? And how many little sneaky sets of exercise are you doing? Again, regardless of your fitness level, just do a little something, something, just, just a little something, whether it be walking some laps, doing you know push-ups against the wall, standing up is still a little bit of something. Even if it's not a lot of resistance, using water bottles as weights, it adds up. It's all a little bit of something. So let's bring some endorphins into our <laughs> shiny Com Days. Oh my God, terrible IVs, not likely, but you gotta try. Can't complain. Oh, I better start putting a down payment on these exercises. As always guys, thank you so, so much for watching. If you are new, please be sure to subscribe. Thank you to everyone who did leave a like as well. And if you'd like additional ways to support the channel, links for Patreon and the merch are in the description down below. I hope you guys have a wonderful, wonderful morning, noon, night, whatever time it is for you. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs>